Hello everyone and welcome to a short preview video of Anthier Student. Uh, Anthier Student is a game currently in development um, where you play a student who has been studying for a long time and now is facing the difficulty of uh, maintaining their student aid benefits, their student benefits, because they haven't been uh, doing as well as they perhaps should have been. So, without further ado, let's jump into a game and see how it works. So, uh, in this version of the game, you start in your room. And what? Let's uh, if we can take a look at what we see here now. We have this lovely art by our artist Laure. Um, over here at the time, it's Monday first, a uh, April Monday, April first. It's not April Fool's. It really is April first. And uh, you have one month to complete a couple of courses in order to keep your student date. Otherwise, you fail the game. Now, this is in 2000. The game is set in 2019, uh, way before any of this COVID nonsense. So there is contact teaching, and you can see people and all that kind of stuff. Uh, but let's take a look at what else they have. So here's the big thing that we need to fill up. This is our study progress. And in order for us to pass the exam, we need to make sure we fill this bar up. And if you hover over here, you'll see that the two courses that we seem to have to be completing in this scenario is the history of heuristics and discovering cultures. And as you can tell, each course, uh, I can't unfortunately hover, hover over with the mouse over there right now, but each course is divided up into 10 subcategories or sub learning groups and uh, we need to do a variety of things to fill these bars we'll get back to that in a little bit now uh, in order to get uh, to fill this study process to get this learning we need to manage our resources well so one of the first resources we have is our mental strength uh, in order to sort of study or do things that that require our mind we need to have mental strength we start off with 10 out of 50 uh, then we have our physical strength, which is com which comprises uh, uh, our food levels, like how hungry we are, and our rest levels, or sleep, as it's called in the game. And there, um, uh, yeah, the physical is sort of a, an average of these two. Uh, and if you run out of either one of these, well, I'm sure I'll show you soon what will happen then. Um, and it starts, so we had a max 50, uh, a max uh, mental strength of 50, but our max food and sleep is only 30. That doesn't sound very good. And finally, we have our social score, which currently does not do that much in the game. But the idea here is that this is about how social we are, how well known, how, how many, uh, not strictly how many friends we have, but more like how many social resources do you have? Um, it's... Um, It'll become somewhat more relevant in later iterations of the game. But for now, there's that. And then we have money. In the test version, we we test when we usually test this thing, we, we play with some amount of money. However, now I've set it to the real thing. In the real game, you start without any money at all. Um, if we go over here on the right, we can see what uh, actions are available in this location. Um, First is uh, clean your room, and uh, down here we see that the cleanliness level of our room is clean and shiny, so we don't have to do that right now. Uh, the cleanliness mechanic is one that's only uh, in effect in your room, and it basically means that the more clean your room is, the happier you are to work in it. So if we spend time here, we do things in our, in our crib, when the room is clean and shiny, we feel good. We get uh, Everything we do gets a, gets a boost, we get more mental strength just from being here. But various things that we can do makes the place messier. And so, uh, which uh, you can imagine, if a clean room makes us feel good and increases our mental strength from being here, a dirty room will do just the opposite and have an extra cost of mental whenever we do anything in here. And now it's clean and shiny, so we don't have to do anything. And our rest, we can do that. Uh, and you can see here in the icons, it, it will tell us that if then we will gain two mental strength, we'll lose two food, and uh, we will lose four uh, sleep. And basically that's because it takes an hour. Wait, no, we'll gain four sleep, yeah. We'll gain four, uh, four sleep, so we'll be resting, so we gain uh, sleep, so to speak. We can't study, it says, because we don't have enough mental strength. 
we can't cook because we don't have enough food. If we don't have enough food to cook, we definitely can't cook a fancy meal. We could go for a run. Let's have a look at that. So I would cost us eight physical. You know what? It's 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 good and healthy to go for a run. So let's take a look at what happens if we do that. So let's go for a half an hour thing. Uh, we don't want to go for that much because, well, that's more physical than we have. So let's just do half an hour. There we go. So what happened? Well, uh, our physical went down, but have a look at this. We just had max uh, physical of 30. Now we have max physical strength of 32. So going for half a run actually improved our physical strength. Now, maybe we should rest a little bit, but I'm not sure about that because while it would gain us some rest, we would lose some food. We don't have to go get some food. And I just realized that going for a run just then might have been a mistake. Uh, because we need money. And uh, we just spent our energy. Yeah, this is this is bad. All right, well, I'll, I'll, I guess we'll show. So, uh, that's... Uh, Never mind, never mind all that. Um, let's let's show more stuff. Let's see what happens. I mean, what what could possibly go wrong, right? Um, I talked about that that certain things are through in this location. So let's take a look at what other locations they are. We start up here on the open, in the lovely crib, uh, and then we could go to campus. We're going to add a SR. We could go to the conveniently close store, uh, K store. Uh, we can go to Porti. We can go to the riverbank. Now, since we don't have any money, I want to try to do something about that. So, let's go to the convenient closed store. Okay, here we go. Now, you might wonder, why do we go to the store if we don't have any money? Well, currently, the only place to earn any money and get uh, is here at the store. Now, I said earlier that I, I felt like I made a mistake by going for a run and that's because I remembered that oh yeah if I want to go here and work for an hour that's gonna take eight mental strength eight food and eight sleep and so what's gonna happen is I pass out now the good news is I still get to keep my money the bad news is we just lost a whole day um, so we also gained uh you know we were taken care of technically we should uh the game should throw us back to our crib when this happens but you know for now we just wake up exactly where we passed out so uh, we lost today is that bad well yes it's bad uh the reason it's bad is because we only have four weeks to complete our learning and that means uh earn enough uh enough learning in all these subcategories to have a decent chance to pass the exam so passing out right there was not great however we have some work we have some uh, money uh, and now we also have some uh, physical strength and stuff because uh, <laughs> yeah because we we passed out all right let's go see some of the other locations then shall we um why don't we go Actually, now that we're here, let's uh, let's buy food ingredients. Ding! Oh, so every now and then, depending on where you are and what you do, uh, special events, uh, random events, almost not completely random, but uh, events may trigger. So now we got to see one of those. This one says the bottle return. You walk past the bottle return machine and notice it has been filled up and is waiting for staff attention. Someone did not have time to wait for the clerk and left a large bag of empty bottles on the floor. Notify staff. Uh, should, oh, okay. should you notify staff and then return the bottles? So I can choose between yes, I need the money. And this will... Uh, seems like it only takes 15 minutes. And it will earn me quite a bit of money. 80. So 80 money is actually uh, 80 cents. Is that right? That's not actually that much, is it? No. Hold on. 80 money is actually 8 euros. Yeah, that's how it is. But then I can say not my problem, which means I don't... Uh, I don't lose any time. And I can do that if I'm in a hurry. So, sure, that's not that much. 
Ah, never mind all this. So one of the things is that, uh, as you can see, the game is currently in alpha. Uh, events are currently a little bit broken in the sense that they only update uh, the stats once we've taken an action. So let's go to the map and go somewhere and you'll see that the map will update. So now we'll have 8 euros. Uh, with that 8 euros, what should we do? Well, we're we're not hungry, so there's no point of going to the Atok Asar, which is a student restaurant. We could go to campus. Let's go to campus just to look around. So, a ray of sunshine. For a moment, through a crack in the clouds, the sun shines down on you. Maybe things aren't so bad. Ooh, free mental. Oh, notice again, this was an event. Now the 8 euros have showed up from the previous event. But the... How much mental strength do we have? 20? That's great. But it hasn't showed up yet. So let's see if we can get it to show up. So in the campus, uh, we have the library, which is not implemented yet. Uh, in the current version, we just have all the books we need all the time. We don't have to go and borrow them. Uh, we have the club room. Uh, we have a campus board, which is a gym uh, facility. And then we have a lecture hall. And there seems to be a class going. Oh my goodness, I'd forgotten. Oh yeah, because I passed out. I have a class or something. Culture basics. Oh shoot. Well, good thing we got some uh, mental strength, even though it didn't update. I really hope we're going to get that mental strength. Doesn't look like we're getting the mental strength. It said we were supposed to get 20 mental strength, didn't it? We're not getting the mental strength. All right, so I don't have a, enough mental strength to... Uh, listen, so I'm just going to listen with one ear and surf the net. Let's take a look. Oh, there's the mental strength now. So, the mental strength was delayed. And so, we got 10 and then we cost 1. So, oh, thank goodness. For some reason, the event uh, traveling to another place did not um, did not get the events to show up. But anyway, now, now we have the mental strength. So now we can actually listen. Let's take a look here. We listen with one ear. Oh, Look at that. We, we we didn't listen that well, so we only have a sliver, just the tiniest sliver of progress in the basics of discovering culture. Let's try to listen a little bit more intently and see how that goes. Okay, so let's take a look. All right, that's a, that's a little better. We, we, we learned maybe a thing or two. All right, but uh, now if we look at the calendar, what happened here? Okay, they look a little bit weird still here, but culture basics is a double lecture, so since uh, another lecture starts right after, uh, we immediately try uh, progress into it. So this is the history of heuristics. Uh, we still have nine mental strength left. We don't have enough mental strength to listen intently. It seems to. It seems that you you need to. Uh, it's not because the cost. It only costs four mental to do this, but uh, the idea here is that in order to actually really pay attention to makes notes, you have to. You have to feel like it and if you have less than 50 and you're just sound like nah, i can't be bothered I, w I, I won't take out my notebook i'll just listen so let's just be like that let's listen okay we have seven mental strength left so let's listen again and i can still listen safely two more times so there oh wait no i can't ah right so once you go under five mental strength you don't even have the capacity even though technically you could pay the price, but you just don't feel like listening anymore. And you get distracted and start surfing the net. So let's uh, halfway listen to last time. Okay, how do we do? How about that? We learn about one third of the basics sitting there at that lecture. Well, good, good, good going, us. Well done. All right, let's take a look now. Can we, oh, I could go to campus. Ah, I can't go to the club room anymore because it's closed. Let's try to go there another time. We'll head over to campus port, see how that's in, that goes. Right, we need 400 money. That's 40 euros. We have 8 euros, so we can't join campus sports yet. But otherwise, we could work out here, take a yoga class, uh, and uh, or, or a judo class. Huh, nice. Uh, but for right now, maybe we should... Uh, I don't have enough mental strength to go to work, so... Let's see what else there is. Let's go to Port, the local bar. Uh, well, this is interesting. The bar should be selling alcohol at this time. I'm gonna 
actually right away open up our team discord here and say uh just type down back here it's like 40 does not sell beer at 2 15 pm wtf all right so let's so i could buy a snack uh so snacks that that sounds good like 10 mental 10 food for uh, only 20 cents only 20 cents again that doesn't sound right it should be more than that actually yeah the the prices aren't exactly adjusted here right uh that should be should be f oh yeah that's two euros it's two euros the stack is two euros it's a little bit funny this way that this is shown the money how, how the money is indicated but uh yeah basically you divide it by 10 and then you see how many euros it is it's uh due to how we programmed it but uh, that will be updated in due course don't worry about it or you can worry about it if you want to but but don't all right i don't usually i wouldn't want to usually do, do this but i'm going to eat a snack now to show what the sort of hidden dangers of eating a snack is so take a good look look carefully at these stats right now see if you can spot it did you spot it we got more mental strength we got more food but look what happened to our max we ate an unhealthy snack Ooh, that's bad let's uh let's let's try to do something about that um well we did get some uh mental strength now so let me see if i can oh I mean, things aren't so bad we got more mental strength so now that we have that i could do yeah let's get some more food all right i'm getting pretty darn tired here but we have 16 euros now that's pretty good i could buy another uh set of food ingredients it doesn't say here but you get 10 food ingredients when you do this so let's pick that up and let's head home okay so let's take a look at this now it's tuesday and we've we've managed to learn something we we're really tired we're kind of in bad shape um i could try to cook but that's kind of a waste because we have 15 food uh Eating a, a snack would just drop our uh, physical even more. So I'll eat a healthy snack. Donk. Uh, okay, that should have actually removed a food. So now I'm wondering why the food did not the food amount did not go down. Let's take a look at that later on. But now we have 25 food. So now I think I can actually uh, survive a sleep. Let's do that. Okay, so as you can tell. We now have 31 max, so sleep also restores some of your uh, max uh, max health. So let's take a look. Let's eat a, another healthy snack. Okay, it seems that the food amount goes down after a delay. That's another thing to write down. The, um, and let's see. Uh, let's see. Uh, someone's already. Um. Oh, what was it again? Oh, that's a... I'm just gonna write. Writing in the Discord just to let, let people know, let my team know that eating food at home. Um, currently, of course, our art isn't updating. It's in the middle of the night, but uh, finish endless summer all year round. Uh, yeah, never mind. Ignore that. All right. So we want to actually, oh, we have 50. We have so much mental strength. Oh, man. I But I do kind of, before I... Now, let's study a little bit and then go for a run. So, let's see. We we started off pretty well. We could try to... Um, let's, let's try to study some uh, terminology, shall we? Uh, we could do like two hours. I would use up 20 of that. All right, let's see. How much progress did that give us? Okay, all right. 
that was a good well spent two hours we have already like uh, almost half of terminology one so that was a that was well well used i think let's see if we can go for a run then it was just half an hour oof all right so now that it's down to three out of 33 it's all it's worth uh cooking a meal uh because then that'll fill us right up yeah that's there we go okay uh 11 rest we still have lots of mental strength let's study some more let me see about this this is uh i'm supposed to what does it say oh i don't have enough uh knowledge on discovering culture right so i need i can't study that oh that's right so uh, discovering culture is uh, is based on lived experience and lived experience I can't get by studying I have to talk to people so we currently haven't yet implemented it's supposed to work so that when you gain social you also gain lived experience which is if you look here the lived experience is 50% out of this discovering culture so it's like a, the idea here is that different courses are, dif are, are different some are plain and simple reading courses like the history of heuristics but discovering culture sure some of it you can read in a book and go to class about but some of it you have to sort of find out through interaction with other people and uh, that's what that is let's see if we can oh it, it's not it's not possible to read this book it's got a high mental cost it's the terms of historical heuristics it's impossible to read for two hours because no one has that much strength so let's just spend half an hour trying to learn some uh, terminology yeah okay now we're getting a little bit tired here so i but i don't feel like sleeping so i'm just going to do an hour's rest and then i guess we could go for another run uh this uh yeah if you're wondering like whoa this is some pretty weird sleeping schedules you have here yes yes it's right and once our sleep function is a little bit more developed eh, we are hoping actually to really think about uh that the more regular your sleep can be, the more effective it'll be. But that's a way off still. We are still working on the uh, basic premises of the game. But yeah, definitely it would be fun. And it's going to, uh, it's in the works, hopefully, maybe, to make the sleep function uh, look at how you sleep. And the more regular your sleep can be, the better it should be for you. But that's, uh, that's a while off. We already have some ideas on how to implement that. But uh if you want to know that that could be implemented by keeping track of w at what time of days you have been sleeping or maintaining some uh seeing if there's like uh if you can yeah basically keeping track of when you sleep and if if you sleep consistently at a similar time then it gets better and the more uh varied it is the worse your sleep will be um uh, and uh but like I said, only sort of basic uh, thoughts about an idea of how to do that yet. Uh, let's go running. But anyway, let's take a look at the calendar. Um, it's a free day today, so we can freely work on uh, on ourselves. Uh, oh my goodness. Oh man. That's one problem with uh, doing this in in <laughs> in the uh, in the client. So I'm actually not playing the application the built version i'm playing a uh, uh playing it in the unity's development studio and i just turned off the game ah <sighs> well that kind of sucks anyway l nothing to it let's do it again i mean um the this is this is still just an intro intro video and the good news is that uh when people play this game they will not accidentally do that because this button won't exist for them can you even see that button oh you can't see it. the button that i clicked this uh i i turned turned off the runtime uh, for unity and of course the game then stopped because i'm an idiot <laughs> anyway back to the thing let's uh something i haven't shown you yet i've um this is this is supposed to just be a short preview video, but I did want it to be a bit longer than that. You have the calendar here. You can this is where you can get back into the a game. Funnily enough, you resume by clicking new game here. <laughs> but uh, yeah, all right. Let's try let's try again, uh, and see if we can get through 
uh, a week or so. So we'll go to the map. We go to conveniently closed store. Ah, teenager. A group of teenagers pass you, make an unbearable noise, and take it up the whole street. You hear them argue about whether our race started zero or one. So either we can click the future is ruined, which would be kind of bad because it takes us all our. Well, let's do that. The future is ruined. Oh no. Sparks and smoke flies imaginarily out of your head. You have exhausted your mental capacity. And that actually does the exact same as the physical, just except the mental. You lose the whole day. And so it is a bad thing. And that means class is going on and I still haven't worked, but I need this money. So I'm going to work a little bit. I'm going to buy some food and let's see if I can catch the end of the class. Yeah, let's run to class. All right, let's go. Oh, someone waves at you across the street. It's your friend, Cuddy. Uh, do you have time? No, no time to chop, Cuddy. Sorry. I, 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 I have class going on. That leaves up the last of my social. So let's, uh, let's listen. Oh, I only have two physical left. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. Let's, so, oh no. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. I have to get out of here. I don't have any money. If I chill out, I'll still lose the food. Maybe I can get to my house. I gotta go. Oh no. The, the lover crib, this is where no magic happens ever. All right, I have, oh no. I can eat the snack. Yes. Let's eat the snack. Whew. All right. So now, actually, let's eat another snack. Oh, wow. Yeah. And because this place is so clean, I feel great about eating that snack. What a great snack. All right. Let's just, let's conk out. Let's sleep. Okay. All right. So the, the class, I learned almost nothing, but we didn't pass out again, which is great. And I'll just make up for it now by studying independently, right? Right. So what was it? It was um. It was the the beginners. Now let's see. Half an hour. It does cost ten mental. It should also tell me that it'll cost me. Uh, for half an hour. That that's um. That's two. So I could actually study for a whole hour. Yes. Now. I need some food, so let's cook a meal. Right, the cleanliness is now only average, so we want to clean up our house a little bit. All right, now I could study some more. Uh, I'll go for a run. Actually, with this amount of uh, with these kinds of stats, I could actually go out. Let's see, is it open? How long? Oh, it's only open till eleven. It's a seven eleven. So can't go there and work now, unfortunately. So maybe I just work on myself a little bit here. Yeah, let's uh, let's go for an hour run again. Oof. Okay, that was maybe a little bit on the hard hard side. Uh, let's see the snack. I only have six food left too. Actually, five now because it doesn't update. I could sleep. I will. And now I want to eat. All right, okay. So let's study a bit. Let's do this again. Uh, now let's just read for a whole two hours. There we go. Take a look at that. I know the basics. Ish. All right, the store's open now. So I guess I could go and earn some money. Wait, Wednesday. Yeah, Wednesday is a Wednesday's a free day. So. We can go and work. Earn a bit of money. Let's see how much work we can manage to do in a day. So let's um, do. So now I'm, I'm out of, I'm out of mental strength. I could eat a snack, and that would allow me to work longer. But that would cost me. But if I didn't eat a snack, I'd have to go somewhere where I could rest. Maybe campus. Let's go. Oh, the club room's open. So now I can become a member. Hop. All right, and the membership allows me to hang out here a little longer, but mainly now I want to just uh, want to chill, rest, and have uh, you know 
So... Wait, they still use a food. Hmm. Snacks here are a bit more expensive than... Uh, how much yeah, is this rest? And then... Uh, so one of the things one of the, uh, things right now is that it takes me just as long to get to the lovely crib as it get takes me to get to the student restaurant over here. The plan is to change the amount of time it takes to walk to your lovely crib. Uh, uh, so that so there'll be an increased cost to go there. All right, let's go to the attic of SR. But, oh, we haven't actually been here before, have we? So uh, here you can see that uh, you can eat just like you can at home, but since this is a sort of social place, you actually gain social by eating here. So there's a little bit of an upside to eat here. So let's do that. Uh, we're still low on mental strength, though. I could have eaten that snack, but I just don't want to do that. Uh, let's go work some more. Oh, an army truck rolls by. You're glad you're not on it. Yeah, sure enough. All right, nice, nice, nice. Okay, uh, we got plenty. Well, say this is plenty of money. It's, it's nothing but a bald-faced lie, so let's not say that. Go here. We should uh, try to... Oh, th it's not very nice here, so let's clean. Oh, maybe I should have looked at my stats before I decided to clean. Well, I may have passed out, but I passed out in a clean and shiny apartment, so... Great. All right. Um, well, here's a problem. We need uh, to up our mental strength before we go. The good news is that we're in a, in a nice and shiny apartment, so... So chilling out here for a little bit should should raise our spirits. Let's take a look. Yeah, we, we managed to get a whopping 22 uh, mental just for hanging out in our nice apartment. So that's great. Uh, however, we are now late for class. So let's go here. Uh, da, 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 da. Uh, discovery. Oh, yes, 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 yes. Uh, I'm, I, um, oh, take a look at this. Now, this lecture is a discussion lecture, and so the options have changed. Instead of uh, instead of uh, the, the listening, we can actually participate. So, good thing we have some social now. Uh, we actually haven't yet implemented the social requirement thing, but now we have some social, so we can actually lead the discussion actively. Here, let's take a look at that. But unfortunately, we were so late, so the, the lecture's over now, and we can't get any more out of it. But let's take a look at our progress. Look at that. We gained some lived experience from actively leading the uh, the discussion. Well, that's great. What about the... What else do we have to do? We do have the history lecture later, so let's not go too far. Turn that. Go to campus. Anything fun going to club? Um, what can we do here? We could uh, hang out just to get some more social. Now, in the real version, social should accrue to our lived experience. It doesn't now, but oh well. But I could rest. Oh, the rest here gives me mental. It, from a game balancing point of view, I wonder if that should stay like that. So it looks a little bit OP, but oh well. I guess the club room has to be a little bit nice. Uh, so let's see. Yeah, we're just gonna hang out a bit more. All right. I think it's. Uh, yeah, the class is starting. So now, look, now that we have 43 mental strength, we are able to listen intently and make notes. So let's do that. Let's do that the whole time. How did that do? Yeah, look at that. We learned something. Um, now what? Can you get a beer already? Ah, yeah, mental boost, that's great not open yet uh, that's we really need to fix that because come on but I have a lot of energy so I think that we want to be good people and uh, go to the store and do some work 22 euros people how about that we've arrived all right let's uh, buy some food ingredients let's buy some more just tablets could I work more 8 8 
Yeah. Bob, who is rich. All right, so... Uh, so while our art in the locations might not update, the map updates according to what time of day it is. Isn't it nice? And then we even have weather effects, so as you may have noticed. All right, 7.15. I'm hungry as heck. Let's... Uh, this could, we could make a fancy meal. Nah, it's not worth it. Um, the cleanliness boost may be a little bit OP as well. We'll see, we'll see. Uh, because not so much point in making a fancy meal. You, you can just hang out in a in a cleanly place and get almost max. We'll see how, how we work on that. Probably need to take down the cleanliness boost just a tiny bit. Hmm. Uh, we can't write that yet. And we can't do that yet. Can we? Oh, we can. Hold on. We have enough. Oh. So let's see about that. So yeah, there's a writing assignment. Uh, and it seems that we have... Yes, we have enough uh, knowledge because we listened so intently in the terminology class. We learned enough so we can start writing on our uh, writing assignment. So let's um, spend an hour doing that. Let's see how the writing assignment is now because, oh, I need more mental strength to be doing this. Um, does this accrue my mental strength? Oh, I can't do that. I'm too tired. Let's sleep. That's a mental strength. So let's take a look here now. Uh, we already got a, a progress of 12% in uh, our writing task. So that's that's not nothing. Now the way this uh, writing task works is that um, you need to have at least 10% knowledge in uh, the topic that it's about. So in this case terminology. Uh, in order for you to be able to start. And then uh, as you write you can only ever get as much progress in the writing task as you have here. So for example, now we can see that we have roughly we have roughly half of terminology one done, and there's three terminology things. So in order to actually get any further on the writing task, um, or very much further, we first have to actually study uh, terminology in order for us to be able to get anywhere. So let's spend half an hour doing just that. And I want only one mental strength left. It's clean. And I pass out. Oh, great. <laughs> yep, okay. I, for, I, I should really, really look at the physical stats before I do that. Yes. Um, can't go for a run because we have enough mental strength. I just don't feel like it. So let's eat a snack. And because we did that in our lovely, lovely apartment, we got some mental strength. So now we can go for a run on... Let's go for two hours. Yeah, we can actually hack it. Look at that. Look at this. We're max physical 54. We are so, we are so healthy. Uh, and now, let's just uh, let's eat a nice fancy meal. Celebrate the fact that we are so incredibly fit. And now I need to sleep. Uh, go to sleep at 1 p.m. Sounds like a student's life to me. Um... And uh, what should we do for the rest of the night? Maybe study some term terminology. That sounds great. Let's do that. So, you might notice that there's not that much yet to do uh, in the game. Although it's already kind of hard to make sure that you don't pass out all the time. Um, study for an hour. Bob. Um... But we are implement. We are planning on implementing more things like the library, where you have to actually borrow, reserve, borrow, and return books and stuff like that, and also uh, parties, where you know you can go to the club room, find out about parties, go to them, meet people, have fun, that kind of stuff. But uh, let me just show you what happens uh, when the weekend comes around. We are also planning weekend events, but for now, the weekend is uh, very very simple. Let's go here, uh, work for an hour, close up shop. Oh, this is weird. This place is supposed to be closed after 11. Yet here we are. That's another bug. Let's see. 
if uh, if you go to work at the store at uh, 22.15, you are still in the store at 23.15, although it should be closed. So another bug, another bug. This, there's a lot of bugs still around, but as I said, this is an early alpha build and a preview build. So part of why I'm doing this playtesting right now is to find those things. But anyway, we have monies now. If we go to the map and we go to Porti, uh, we should not be able to go back here because it's closed. But it seems we need to still actually kick you out of there. Uh, when it's not closed, we have to see how that works out. Anyway, I promised I'd show you what um, we have the riverbank. Here's the thing, place to. Currently, we can only sometimes rest here, study, and hang out. But uh, as with everything, there's plan to develop develop this later on as well. Once we have the basic functionalities, let's just rest by the river for now. Okay, so as you can tell, what happens is. Actually, that's not right. It should not go to this time on Monday. But yeah, currently the, the, the weekends are just skipped and you come back sort of on a Monday. But uh, yeah, it should actually come back later in the morning on Monday. But anyway, that's the next week. And so here you go. You can see the different, uh, the new week. We have lectures at slightly different times. And... Uh, the game would go on. Yay! So thanks for joining me for this uh, preview. Um, if you would like uh, to be on uh, a list of people that are interested in doing a closed uh, alpha test, a closed testing of this, then wherever you are seeing this video, uh, leave a comment, send a message, tweet, reply to tweet, um, reach out and we will put you on a list of people who might want to be a, a tester. I won't say beta tester because we're not in beta yet, we're still in alpha. But uh, if you want to be a tester, then uh, let us know. And uh, we can't promise you that you'll get to be one because we only have resources to uh, for so much. And uh, communicating with testers and going through test reports takes up time as well. But let us know if you want to be a tester and you can be a part of uh, helping making this game uh, more stable and have more features and just be better. So if you are interested in helping our team uh, develop and your student, like I said, be in touch. For now, thank you so much for watching and uh, I hope you liked what you saw. Bye-bye.